Hey there, good evening. Rich Nye, the sports guy, has returned this fall for a limited engagement. Although at this point, I think we have to call it an encore performance, perhaps by popular demand. Or maybe Dave Calabro just has a lot of time off when he's been here more than 30 years, even longer than me. Anyway, it feels like a homecoming tonight, and we start with a homecoming at Cathedral. Our 2022 homecoming. Cathedral football was well represented on the homecoming court, and no need for halftime adjustments up 21-7 on Brebuff. Lucy Clark is crowned homecoming queen, and senior wide receiver Jerron Tibbs is the king. Fighting Irish put a royal beat down on Brebuff. Cathedral quarterback Danny O'Neill runs in for a six yard touchdown early in the third quarter. The student fans celebrating on neon night. Rebuff had a chance to get right back in the game, but sophomore quarterback Maverick Geske threw three interceptions. Keyshad Caldwell ends the scoring threat with an end zone pick. Check out this grab by the homecoming king. Tibbs leaps for a 34-yard catch. He'll take those skills to Purdue next season. O'Neill is Cathedral's career leader in TD passes. He finds Keith Long for a 26-yard touchdown pass to open the fourth quarter. And the Fighting Irish defense joins the scoring just 10 seconds later. Stu Smith takes the tip pass 44 yards the other way for a pick six. Cathedral is up 42-7 to initiate the running clock. The Buff found some offense against the Cathedral Reserves in mop-up time. Jack Myers breaks a big one for the Braves. And Geske threw a pair of touchdown passes. This one to Nolan Buckman. But the Irish win 42-21. Cathedral's only loss is to top-ranked Brownsburg.